hello traders it's samurai trader here welcome to this session how to master the art of day trading this is my first public video for 2019 so welcome in today's video I'll be giving you some tips and ideas for trading in 2019 and hopefully you go wow they are great tips because I've got some real good stuff I want to share with you today I'm going to try to keep it under 30 minutes so it won't be uh, too long as always traders my videos are raw real and unedited so I'm not running to a script whoops we'll go back to that <laughs> slide there so if I fluff up anything as we go uh, you'll have to forgive me so first of all a little comment down the bottom there is uh, every master was once a beginner every professional was once an amateur if you're a brand new trader some of the ideas that I may share with you today may be a little advanced you may go wow I'll never pick that up but trust me you will within 30 days you'll have what I call aha experiences it ain't rocket science it really isn't also because I'll be showing you charts from the futures markets whatever I show you works equally as well on stocks or Forex uh, and naturally futures that we'll be looking at uh, because all markets are what we call fractal in nature anyway so uh, a setup that will work brilliantly on, on futures markets will work equally as well on any other market I, I will say providing you've got some volume and of course you've got a market that trends if you're in a sideways choppy market or the time or it doesn't matter really or there are a couple of strategies that may work but most won't so as long as we've got some volume and a trending market so with that being said uh, I do have to put up a risk disclaimer there is a risk in trading please make sure you master the art of trading use the simulator before you go live all right very very important give yourself a good 60 to 90 days traders before you even consider going live and one of the advantages of modern trading platforms today is you can trade in sim using the simulator as long as you like and so it's really important that you launch your career the right way but once again look we could spend hours and hours talking about this but there's some specific things I do want to show you a very quick ad advertisement if you don't already have my free training manual please uh, click the link below or visit my website I've got a free training manual I've also got a, an ebook for truth about day trading lots and lots of good stuff in there uh, if you haven't already please subscribe to my channel and even better still why don't you join and become a member of a day traders fast track program for $197 you get all of my strategies free indicators there's a ton of stuff there is now there's actually over 300 hours of online videos there step by step and I do new videos almost every week that's the end of the advertisement so let's get into some really good stuff okay I want to teach you or at least give you some something to think about and something to really start to focus on but I want to start with this let me start with the power of questions traders I've now got to, I think it's over four and a half thousand members now and uh, I've got a very large private coaching group that I deal with uh, some on a weekly basis others are monthly but I've got a, a I think it's four and a half thousand general members of a day traders fast track program so I get dozens of emails every day and the big thing that really is absolutely key besides consistency and discipline is really is mindset your mindset is everything when it comes to trading it truly is and you know I'm going to show you a couple of concepts today that are 80% as far as winners go however you are going to have three or four losing trades in a row at times and the issue is that most traders they have three or four losing trades in a row hopefully that's not too often but when they do all of a sudden they think their strategy is broken they start looking for what we call the next shiny object they want to chop and change so we've also got this other issue it's this many traders and we know that over 95 percent of traders have been or have lost money in the past and you know I've got to say don't let the shadow of your past hold your future hostage it's just really important traders that you know you watch your self-talk and such as you know traders typically will say this why does this always happen to me can I really do this which creates a massive feeling of self-doubt because the answer is yes you can uh, all, all the statements and I hear this all the time oh that won't work or this won't work you know I want to seriously I want to give traders a good slap around 
around every now and then and say wake up to yourself watch what you say to yourself because words can either be empowering or disempowering you know what we say to ourselves so as we go through this I want you to have you know pad out and I want you to be saying to yourself what can I learn from this how can I use this what's great about this you don't have to like me I don't care I'm here as your coach because I am going to give you ideas and strategies that can set you financially free but you know what if you're not facing in the right direction or if you're going or using the mentalities this won't work or no I can't do this well guess what you're right so anyway enough of that I just wanted to mention that just been answering a lot of emails today and the big thing is self doubt the traders have you can do this and this is where really you know traders that have a compelling future can really do great things so this is what I want to start off with with at my very first public video uh, I've already done two members Q&A videos for the uh, for the year but this is a public one so what I want to do is really let's set some income targets look whether you become a member of my program or invest in my program or not it doesn't really matter so I want you to forget that for a moment okay I want you to focus on what I'm about to present to you and I want you to get asking how can you achieve this okay this is what I'm about to show you what can I learn for this so first of all a poor man or woman is not one without a cent but one without a dream so it's very very important that you've got a clear direction for where you want to take your day trading this year because as I say here if you can see it in your mind in, in your mind you can hold it in your hand and it's very very important so let's consider what I believe is a realistic income uh, or a realistic in income target for a trend trader it's actively day trading three to four hours a day now fortunately traders we can day trade virtually 24 hours a day so if you'll say where most of my clients are either right in the USA or in the UK you can get home from work and there's always something happening you can trade the Vic Lobex market if you're trading futures you can um, trade the markets from 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time onwards or tw or 24 hours a day five days a week you can trade the Forex markets you've got incredible flexibility and of course here what you can do here traders is start off by trading two to three hours a night maybe four when you get home from work build up your account then go full-time but what I want to show you here is our objective here is netting 200 a day per contract traded okay now there are some rules to it which we'll cover in a moment so I know that this is a realistic income if you're day trading three to four hours a day you should be netting once you're gaining your experience a bare minimum of 200 a day which is an overall net target of a thousand a week now to do this we need need to be targeting 300 a day because you are going to have losses that is a reality you will have down days hopefully not too many but by targeting your 300 that's 1500 a week it covers your down days now in my coaching group um, I run private coaching as well so I've got a lot of private coaching clients and we, we have this thing called five by five yes I can five by five yes I can as I said this is about getting in state it's about the head stuff traders it makes a difference when you're focused and confident and you're willing to click that trigger you're willing to, to pull the trigger to place a trade um, because unfortunately so many traders are so fearful by the time they do click it the trades over it's very very important you develop the personal confidence now it's very very important that you also have competence with that confidence okay that's why we start off by trading in sim until we master it so we've got this concept this is for our scalpers it's called five by five and five winning trades by fifty dollars each so if you're trading the ES for an example that's four ticks that's one point that's five one point trades a day if you're trading CL the black gold that's five ticks is fifty dollars okay so whatever market you're trading now we also have a, a setup called the 2b which is an absolute kick butt trend following strategy it's 
brilliant okay um, I'd love to tell you I invented these strategies that I teach well look I'm a, I'm a researcher I've been doing this for 25 years now I look for the best of the best if I have to I'll re-engineer or reverse engineer and look at what makes something but these are all great strategies okay trend following strategies so now I've got my crew the traders going five by five yes I can three by eight yes I can so we're going for both now that's over 400 a day when you understand the strategy you can see this is achievable if you put in the work in now all right you traders that have been that have blown your accounts already been skeptical okay draw a line in the sand and let's look at how you can do this traders okay all right what, what look for psychological damage it has done to traders that have blown their account a number of times is it, it's a real condition it seriously is psychological damage it's done um, and so it's very very important that we start to recondition you your past and what you've invested in your career up till now if it's been a losing one has only been part of your education it's been the cost of getting you to where you are now so let's draw a line in the sand and let's start perhaps doing things differently such as if you haven't been profitable up till now trading with the trend only okay so let's just have a look at what this means I want you to jot this down uh, very very important or you can actually replay this and and go back and take notes but here if you're going to trade futures I really recommend traders that you're starting off with a minimum of five thousand dollars look you can do it with four thousand but what is very very important is our risk management is we never risk any more than two percent or around maybe 2.2 2.5 maximum but really the lower the better so if you've got say a $100 stop okay um, you know you, you want to have around 5,000 in your account okay because that's um, a 2% very very important you've got that you know you, you manage your risk okay now if you're achieving 100 a day net so at the end of a week you're netting 500 after your commissions after your losses all that sort of thing okay we can see here that by week uh, 37 you've built your account up to 114,000 and you're now netting $10,000 a week now I know you can't really live on it okay but you can certainly pay a few bills and that's trading 22 contracts and only netting $100 now let's look at what's the effect of netting 200 a day per contract so remember we want to be targeting 300 let's allow for our down days starting with 5,000 we can see here that by week 16 we're now earning over ten thousand dollars a week okay so within that within that time we're up to now trading 11 contracts netting around the ten thousand within 15 16 weeks now of course we can get over here that then we're up to a hundred uh, weekly income that's up to a hundred thousand trading a hundred contracts and you may notice here I cap it out because we've also got to be realistic with our goals now you've heard me say probably if you're uh, a member of mine in the room uh, watching this video which I know many of you will end up getting this even though it's for the general public there are old traders there are bold traders and there are but there are no old bold traders which means as we go on in time we become more conservative and it's really a myth there's you know the amount of multi-million dollar traders that trade their own money is only a very small percentage and also when we get into trading around 100 contracts we've got to look at the markets the time of day that sort of thing if you're trading 10 contracts say after hours no problems but you start trading 100 contracts on oil or gold or, or forget it on the NQ during the say the Globex hours it's just not realistic okay so here where I'm assuming you're then building your account to trade during the New York hours but the the, the end result here is only $200 and here and I actually didn't explain this to you and here's how it works I'm assuming here that you only start trading an additional contract when you double your money there are lots of compound strategies around where yes you're using the markets money you can start trading more but here if you start off with 5,000 in your account when you get to 10,000 you can now start trading two contracts when you get to 15,000 you can start trading three 
when you get to 20 you can start trading for we're using the markets money and as many of you know I say to traders and I've got a lot of wealthy traders with me and I say look even if you've got two three four five hundred thousand dollars you haven't earned the right to start trading that sort of money it's very important you still start out in sim using the simulator and you start with one contract once you qualify you double it you go to two maybe do that until you've done that up to 10 contracts then maybe introduce some of your own money besides that initial 5,000 earned the right trades I promise you that it'll make a massive difference and you will be super successful but if you try to cut corners it just doesn't work so what we can see here is earning 200 a day per 5,000 okay within 16 weeks we're earning potentially 10,000 a week now with that if we go and look at this five by five yes I can and we're going to look at some charts in a moment I'm not going to go through all the strat but I'm going to all the strategies in great detail but I'll give you an overview okay what you'll soon see is you can be scalping and for my members watching this your five by fives are your 34 B's your, your standard t1s your slingshots your t2s they're your five by fives and your two b's are your three by eights because your two b's overall will give you 10 ticks plus generally speaking okay they're a, they're a much higher return trade and as we know they'll generally be a, an 82 percent type trade in that sort of vicinity if you're trading it correctly to the rules but that's how we get to our 200 either you go and combine both of those which is real okay then all of a sudden you're up to 400 a day so very quickly what if you earn the stripes you do your internship you're up to 300 a day and what we can see here within nine weeks we're up to 10,000 and just the last one and let's just say you're a super trader you've earned the right you you trend trading maybe taking your your really uh, your and for members watching this your 1d's your 2d's and your 3d divergence trades okay they kick butt as well right you're on your 400 a day look at your income level okay um, within potentially within 15 weeks okay you've got 800,000 in your account how do we do that you trade in your ones actually let me show you this this is a sheet of tomorrow um, it's actually Tuesday down under here I've got a, a 90 minute session for new members then after that I've got a new one-to-one -one, uh, coaching client I'm working with and so he owns trade station he owns a few of the indicators he, he also owns the, the TM2 the trade master so these are the setups for a one-to-one -one session uh, just a, a cheat sheet that I've designed for him do I have a t1 so if you said to me which are the best of the best to trade the kick butt with here's what I'm training him on so for my current members please take note the t1 the t2 the 34b the 2b the t4 after the 2b because as we know that works brilliantly and 200 EMA overshoots and there's a number of other things just qualifying the trades and things like that do I have a 200 EMA overshoot because that kicks butt as well now what we have to be aware of is this and so for all traders we we suffer from what we call um, decision fatigue the more things that we're looking on our charts particularly in our first six months the more exhausted we become it really a couple of hours of really focusing on 10 or 15 trade setups and particularly if you're trading more than one market you become fatigue it's called decision fatigue there's also another concept which works hand in hand with that it's called ego depletion that is the more decisions that we make and that what they're now saying and these are scientific studies done on both of those is that it's like a well we only have so many resources in that well and the more that we draw of those we run out of them quickly we're more likely to start making mistakes now with these here these are all very very closely related and some of these as we know will plot within one or two candles of each other okay then the 2b is a little different along with the t4 and the 200 but they're all very 
closely related so as a new trader if you're watching this is one of my new members okay the t2 34b and the 2b they're the ones I would be saying focus on those because the t1 comes in to it all naturally all right very important that you do that so what we can see is by creating a compelling future that is and let's just go back to something that's very realistic is that two to three hundred dollars per day per contract you trade you can have financial independence for life it's very very important that the bigger the the how, the why why you want this the new home the cars the travel the financial independence been able to work from your home office the rest of your life the, the the how becomes easier okay it becomes a lot easier to learn when you've got a big enough compelling future and traders um, uh, and this is for new traders trading really is 90% head stuff it really is and I spend an enormous amount of time with traders working on the head stuff because trading really is 90% psychology 5% money management and 5% the strategy so what's your plan of action to achieve this traders whether you're a member of mine or not is that okay all of these are trend following strategies all right irrespective of size of the trades of course then uh, we'll look at the, the the charts in a moment but you go and use the ATR for an example you can go and pick up um, 22 ticks in one move if you use the ATR for your exits okay so these are very very realistic strategies so very quickly just want to before we go to the charts I want to show you this all right this is um, just one of my members here uh, uh, from uh, October 2018 all right we're just talking about how some traders say oh can't be done or you can't do this oh, well look you know go away that's what I say to them is that um, I've got just traders kicking butt with the 2b and the reason the 2b is so great as a strategy we're using at least two time frames with it and it kicks butt and what this is great book you can so you can go and purchase this book high probability trading strategies by Robert minor now in that book Robert talks about using multiple time frames as he says it's the most powerful approach he's discovered in over 20 years now what he says here is this the multi time frame strategy is not a standalone system okay but when it's included as part of a part of a, a trade plan with time price and pattern strategies you've got a you've got a powerful trade plan now he talks about some of those in his book uh, look I've in, incorporated what I teach with it and it just kicks butt but what we're actually using is at least two time frames so I'm showing you this okay now with that comes with making sure that we're trading with the trend and many of you of course have heard of this or seen the movie um, uh, city slickers and where we got curly there he talks about that one thing and epic success particularly as well it's really for all traders but as a day trader really comes down do I have a fanning of the EMAs am I fanning or sorry am I trading in the direction of the trend and if we look at this here so the dark blue line we represent as our higher time frame and these little pullbacks this is what we're waiting for with our strategies whether it be the t1 the t2 the 34b uh, or the 2b and by the way I, we give them codes because otherwise you, you're calling it great big long names all the time that's why we code them and look within 60 days you've learned them down pat anyway they're all rules based strategies very important and so winner 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 then you get into these where you get your great divergence trades initially you want to avoid these okay you you, you want to learn them and the reason you need to learn divergence you've got to also know when to stop trading very important okay nice short nice short you want to learn how to trade these these are all the secrets well this is a secret to massive success of that two to four hundred dollars a day now 
tr what I state here is this and that's true trading is nothing more than a pattern solving exercise the market has a memory we see these same patterns in the market every day it's like the 200 EMA overshoot do you know whether you're trading a one minute chart or a one hour or a 500 tick or a 10,000 tick you get the 200 EMA overshoot pattern appears in that market each and every day right the t1 the uh, the the t2s the um, the two but the, these are all patterns right and that's just so important because when we go and talk about um, mark Douglas one of the key things that he says in his book uh, and uh, gee, I'm just trying to think the name of his book right the disciplined trader is that to master the art of trading find something that is pattern based okay and start from there but also as he states here become an expert at one market behavior at one particular pattern that repeats itself with a degree of frequency then once you master that build from there these are the secrets but you know what so many traders are just not willing to do this you know winning traders are willing to do the things that unsuccessful traders won't do and unfortunately some of the things that I'm telling you now some traders want to start trading straight away they want to go live straight away and what they're doing is is building their foundation on sand they have a couple of um, uh, some rough weather their foundations washed away and they're blown their account this is what happens traders are not patient enough because anyone can start trading anyone can buy a book or do a course and all of a sudden they think they're trading they're not getting the right training so you've got to start somewhere now so you saw the, uh, the part of the email there from one of my members it's killing it using the 2b it's just as you'll see in a moment it's just a kick butt strategy this is another one this is a member that some um, also mentioned the word killing at the moment he's been a member of mine for years and what he's done his name's uh, Ashley Mogg and Ashley has actually now coded the t2 and um, for general members watching this he's actually going to start retailing it so drop me an email and I'll, it's going to be selling for around 500 US dollars it's for ninja trader 8 at the moment he's about to do it for ninja trader 7 as well so uh, at the moment it's done for the t2 the slingshot which I've taught for years and here are seven trades after commissions um, 660 per contract there uh, here it is again automated entries set targets okay well don't know what it works out to be about 500 per contract but either way the strategy works I didn't show you all of his emails what he has to say about it but bottom line is it's very very straightforward and this is on uh, the yen uh, on gold the, the currency markets it works on any market virtually of a slingshot it's just a brilliant strategy now we're going to run out of time soon so look let's go and let me show you a couple of things here's the first thing I want you to consider many of you are already using time-based charts many may be using Renko and I just want to quickly show you how I use Renko and tick charts together because one of the challenges that we have with Renko which is a, a, a just a beautiful way of smoothing out price action but one of the challenges with that it also hides some valuable information okay so um, I, I just want to show you this because uh, using Renko if you're a struggling trader it will it'll truly fast track your success okay so let's have a look at this all right now what we're looking at here this is uh, oil we're looking at CL today so we this is the globe session so just a bit after midnight here we can see here um, uh, and so it's fairly choppy and this is also a four brick a four point Renko so it's fairly high in time frame during the globe session it's good to consider and to even look at the two so this is a two brick and let me just uh, go up to where it is here now so we can see here beautiful divergence let me just move this up the top here what you can't see and I'll show you this in a moment because I've got multiple screens this is um, uh, the two and the four up above I've got um, my two main anchor charts so here I'd normally be showing my dome my execution platform uh, what have I got here yep this is the demo one let me just go to that so here you'd normally trade off this one 
so this is just our demo one so normally you could trade off this here is your lower time frame and above I've then got an anchor chart one and an anchor chart two let me show you what that looks like here it is here so this is what you'd normally see is that so here I've got a seven and a 12 much higher so these are my much higher time frames so what we want to be doing traders is trading in the direction of our ultimate higher time frames okay and this is the beauty of the two B's where we get these two B trades okay these two B's now that move there by the way 20 40 60 81 20 40 60 82 before you had your first reversal candle that was a $200 move after assuming you got in on the close of the third candle what was our overall target we're talking about 200 a day now see the black dot there sorry the blue dot that's my ATR now you can use a parabolic you can use the uh, trigger line there's a lot of ways here to which you can use to stay in the trade but let me just scroll back because it, it's the afternoon it's Sunday evening uh, midnight um, uh, over in the US so we've now gone into a real period of chop until London opens so going back earlier this is the open of the session okay so we had some nice little trends but if we go back and if there's not enough price action what you do just simply drop down your time frame and this is what we call a 2b right there okay that's also a 2b right there if we scroll along this is also a 2b right and with the two B's and here is a 34 B right there trend and that by the way is a slingshot so you got a 34 B a slingshot a 2 B now let me tell you traders these are virtually 98% mechanical trade entries now all right for all the negative doom and gloom people there how do we know we'd get in well as long as the markets moving and this is the great thing about which I do love about the globe session these moves the market is moving that uh, 16 okay that was over three minutes okay that was a three minute move and if uh, you've got trade station I give you my indicators um, are free of charge if you've got trade station and I've also had the t1 coded for ninja trader and I teach you the rules anyway even if you've got another trading platform you know what it is I set the alert so very simply I'll set up the, um, the t1 alert so it alerts me when the white paint bar goes off but that doesn't go off until I get an uptick on the third candle okay so don't so I'm misleading you but see here the, the ATR I've got you can stay in as long as you got the ATR until it what we call flips all right but uh, I only have that for trade station I, the parabolic are you can get for any platform okay so I teach you how to use that for uh, on, on other platforms as well but the point I wanted to get back on digressing here is trading with the trend now this is all great look how lovely and smooth it is but one of the challenges is when you get these great moves on Renko you can also miss out that is if you scalp the market so you're getting out six to eight ticks and you're out of the market you can miss out on some good moves so this is where I love to have the tick charts this here this is an 89 so I'll just tell you what my readings are so on on CL during the globex session I love an 89 tick and during the New York session I like the 233 tick okay so New York I use a, a 233 tick is my entry chart and the anchor is a 610 for the globex session I use an 89 tick and my anchor is a 233 tick so what you can see let's just go back to this here for a moment so see you've got that move right there it's very very smooth now you might be out up here are there any other opportunities to get in the market because we don't have any pullbacks here if we look at our 89 tick chart at that time and let me just scroll over here for you that was that move here so you actually had an entry there and you had another entry here all rule space by the way so the advantage of Renko is it really smooths out the price action it makes it so much easier to read the market 
but once again there's a price to that okay that is you can sometimes miss those second and third entries and that is where then your tick charts come in okay you can get those lovely moves now then you've got up here and this is important what do we got here we had a great pivot bounce look at that beautiful divergence okay so what's happening on the tick charts so we had it on the Renko sorry on the Renko there it is on the Renko let's have a look at my higher time Renko I've got some divergence there I also have not only have I got a pivot bounce I've got divergence a pivot bounce I've also got the 80 cent level bounce now for anyone that is new to CL or maybe you're unaware with this of this with CL if you do trade uh, the black gold oil at the at the round numbers at the 48 in this example at the 20 cent and 80 cent levels these are what we call price magnets and price will bounce off these levels every day day in day out they really do they're just so darn reliable they really are look here's one here so this is also going back to Friday's price action so this is Friday just gone so we can see here price rallied up you can't quite see it there that's 4820 now here if you look at that I don't have any obvious divergence okay but when I go and let's just go and do this let's go and have a look at my higher time frames what are they telling me uh, where are they where is it here we go right there so look at the higher time frames I've got divergence okay I've got a pivot bounce there it's telling me there but then what's my tick chart telling me at that stage so the tick chart is giving me a lot of information there and want to look over at my anchor chart see that formation there traders this is what we call a 200 EMA overshoot notice how the candles also have separated from my blue trigger line we see this pattern every day it kicks butt now it's a lot easier if you're a trader say with two or three or four screens it's, it's a lot more difficult if you're only trying to trade off one screen but you, you've got to start somewhere but let me just go back to the 89 tick here and I just want to see if we've had any and here was one here so just today here is all right a great what we call a bubble formation notice how we're sort of slightly gapping away here notice how I've got divergence and here is another 200 EMA overshoot right there that's what we call see how I've got price action gapping away from the trigger line and it's past the 200 EMA see that bubble type formation these are a very very mechanical trade entry that we see every day and here's another one from today all right so there was one there and there was one there and the, and the rules are very very set these black dots this is actually a parabolic I've set up there when I train members to show them how to use the parabolic but that is a bubble that's a 200 overshoot bubble now I've just thrown seven or eight terms to you or trade potential trade setups and yes I know you don't know the rules yet so we've gone a little over over your head maybe but they're mechanical setups they're very very mechanical now these are also setups you won't trade until you're tr profitably trading with the trend okay because that is a counter trend okay so you've just got to really watch it you want to be trading with the trend very very important so let's now have a look at have I gone through that for you uh, okay traders I've actually covered everything for this um, uh, for this particular session I wanted to cover so the, the key point here is you can master the art of day trading it doesn't have to be complicated you will have aha experiences give yourself 90 days start by trend trading only but get the right education traders trade with the trend but first of all I want you to have a massive future I want you to be thinking okay this is the potential if you don't have five thousand dollars where do you start you start off by trading for Forex markets you start by trading minis and you then you go to a standard lot so you start with maybe five hundred to a thousand dollars yes I know that um, you know you're going to be earning pennies in the hour but you can learn the skill set 
once you get to a certain size account then you can move over to futures if you wish right but you can start somewhere and that's the beauty with say Forex so compared to say stocks or even futures you can start very small and build your account the markets are going to be here next week next month the next year so what if it takes you six months to build your account traders in the meantime you can master the art of the patterns okay where you can recognize them and trade them in a blink of an eye but what we've got to do we've got to change the mindset of many traders that they can do this overnight you can do this this is extremely achievable provided you you get the right education and you train yourself correctly from day one so in closing traders uh, what I'd like to recommend once again if you haven't subscribed to my channel please do visit my website even better still become a member and you get all of this ah and one more thing hang on traders for members that are watching this this is what I was going to show you that little um, uh, that spreadsheet of the uh, income I've actually had code one of our members did this for me Oops. this is on my Google Drive so if you go to my Google Drive there it's in a folder there called daily target compound sheet so you can now download that if you want to play around with the inputs I'm going to do a little training video on it uh, in the next three or four days but there you can put in how much capital you're starting with how much per day and it's a compound so I've actually had that coded for you, you can now download that now one other thing which a lot of members have been asking that is um, as you know on my Google Drive there we've got hundreds of videos now and what I hadn't done for some time is updated my spreadsheet I'm now updating every one of the videos I've ever produced uh, for members and putting it on uh, this spreadsheet so check it out that the it should be done at the end of this week now also don't forget traders uh, at, at this stage you'll all be under masters but in the next few weeks I'm going to break them down the strategies with uh, like whether it's live trading whether it's for CL NQ ES etc all right so that will be done uh, in the next uh, few weeks but the very important thing here traders is that every video that's on my Google Drive will be there and <laughs> last of all well I've got my members here is of course don't forget and a lot of members are forgetting this whoops this is getting me where is it here uh, where are we here we go okay is that all the new links to all of the new videos that I'm doing so where it says new recordings and uploads okay remember to check in there most weeks all right so basically every new upload and video I do I put within that folder okay so it's within new recordings and uploads and one more thing which you will want to know about if you're using ninja trader race uh, we've now had coded for ninja trader race the ATR stop and flip that I use has now been coded by one of our fantastic members has coded that it's only available for ninja trader 8 so the ATR stop and flip I use you can now download off my drive there okay along of course with a pile of other indicators that were provided but we've now got that for NT8 so now we will wrap this up thanks members and uh, general public hope to see you as a member shortly thank you